What's up guys, Martin back here with another video. So, I was out side, and I can't even hardly say that without thinking about that chick that says, catch me outside. Catch me outside, how about that? Uh, and my nephew says it too, I just wanna slap the shit out of him. Uh, today I was out and I was shooting some photographs, such a pretty day, there was a little bit of cloud cover this morning, uh, and I took a really cool shot, and then I thought, you know what, it's very, very difficult just to make an entire uh, video around one photograph now granted I could probably do like a photo editing video or something I just don't know how interested you know my audience uh, in particular is uh, about that kind of thing so I decided against it uh, if you guys are interested maybe you know drop me a comment let me know but what I was also thinking about too is that you know I don't know nine times out of ten all we talk about is gear uh, sometimes I'll throw out some philosophy and some uh, some thought process uh, videos out there I don't really think us as a photo video community really showcase exactly what we do as much and I would really like to change that. I was kind of looking around on the interwebs and was trying to find you know different places where maybe we could uh, all share our work. Um, I know that there is like you know Facebook and Flickr and all the regular ones um, but I wanted to make it extremely easy uh, for you know everyone and I don't really know what the best option would be. Now, I'm a part of several different uh, photography communities. I'm on like 500 pixels. I really don't do Facebook much anymore. You basically had to sign your life away and you know the rights to your firstborn and everything to uh, use their apps. And I don't know, man, I'm just not down with all that. But I am still a part of Instagram. And I thought, you know what? It might be just as easy to uh, hop on Instagram, develop our own hashtag or something that way you know, no one has to change anything, no one has to join anything new. Uh, we can all just throw our favorite images uh, up on the Instagram and then hashtag it so that, you know, if we want to be engaged with one another, we can go that route. But that was just an idea. Uh, there's no real way on Instagram that I can tell that you can form a group uh, without creating an entirely new account and then you guys uploading uh, photos or videos and then me having to collect all of those photos and videos and put it on that one account. So I mean it just seems really awkward and uh, clumsy. I would have suggested something like Flickr but Nobody hardly uses Flickr anymore. I mean, it's basically, for me, uh, an image storage website. And that's the honest to God's truth. Uh, I really, I just don't use it for much uh, other than that. Uh, most of the stuff that I want to showcase or whatever, it goes on, you know, something else. So, like, most of my digital art right now, I've got it on Instagram. And my photography and stuff, I usually put it on 500 pixels. So, I was wondering what you guys actually used. What you guys uh, actually like to uh, which websites you're subscribed to where you like to share your work on uh, and if you even do you know I mean surely to God some of you have got to be proud of at least a few photographs that you've taken in the past and you'd like for other people to see them now I've posted a video before I absolutely hate photo critiques I have absolutely no desire whatsoever to critique your photographs. Uh, I figured that that would be a really cool way for us to um, kind of share our work, share what we're doing, say on a specific day or whatever. And I have basically resigned to thinking that Instagram may be the best so that if we come up with a new project or something, if we decide, hey, let's focus on this particular activity, say like macro photography or uh, food photography or just whatever the case may be. That way we can use a base uh, hashtag combined with, you know, whatever the project is. So it'd be like, I don't know, I'm not going to say it right now just in case it's a horrible, horrible idea, but I'm basically fleecing you guys, the community, and trying to see if you guys would even be interested in something like that. I'm not opposed to it at all. I mean, I like to sometimes, you know, share my work. If I've taken a really good photograph, you know, something personal. Uh, but on occasion, I do uh, a lot of, bl my favorite in particular is black and white fine art photography. I do that a lot. And I love uh, detail photos. I love close-ups and macros uh, and stuff like that. So th that's kind of my shtick. Like, I love fine art, black and white photography. If you guys have any ideas about maybe where we could hang out, share our photographs with each other, especially the ones we're super duper proud of, then maybe you guys could throw some ideas out there, drop them down in the comment section below. Let me know uh, what you guys would like to do. I mean, I would really like to see what some of you guys shoot. It's, it's weird, literally, all of us being photographers 
talking to each other for you know years in some cases i've got some viewers that have been around since i was uh, just starting out so for some of you it's been almost six years and i honestly have not seen much of any of your all's work that's all we got for you guys today and if you have any questions comments concerns qu uh, you know uh, suggestions or whatever drop them down in the comment section and let's get this thing going so at any rate i'll see you guys in the next one peace